hey how's it guys welcome to the channel firstly a very happy new year i don't know how happy happy is gonna be but at least 2020 is behind us let's hope 2021 is much better secondly my deepest apologies for this video not being out yesterday it was new year's eve and i was kind of distracted my boys are here I was actually playing Super Mario Brothers <laughs> Retro. <laughs> it was quite fun. And then I lost track of time and then it became evening and then I got some little bit of drunk. And I did record some audio but I was a little bit too drunk so I just let that go. So for this video I've just put the 21st of December there at the beginning. And I put all the dates of the 21st until the 31st of December, the actual time and direction of sunset. And I was actually quite baffled when I was double checking with dateandtime.com because the sunsets seem to get later, not earlier. And a comment on a recent video the guy said how do I actually know when is the exact summer solstice and with this observation and getting the numbers for the last couple of days it got me thinking um, I don't really understand the whole cycle I just know that the sun is bouncing back and forth between these two points and obviously I'm going to need a hell of a lot more observations to come to more coherent conclusions. One of the things I did want to mention about was the solar minimum. I don't know if you guys heard but apparently now the sun is in its lowest intensity phase so the sun has many cycles and this one i'm talking about is the 11 year cycle and apparently the sun isn't supposed to be so hot or should i say as hot as when it's at its solar maximum but what i can tell you about the last couple of days here just outside pretoria is that it has been a scorcher the humidity levels were very high, up to 45%. And the amount of cloud, as you can see in these clips, is just too much. And we get very minimal rain, and it just comes and goes. Barely a storm, actually. But the heat is to the point of unbearable. You can be just sitting down in the shade and because it is so humid, you just sweat yourself away. So I don't know exactly what the deal is with the solar minimum, but the weather here is definitely hotter. And I have spoken to a couple of people who have spent a lot more years here than I have. I've only been living here for about five years. I actually come from the KZN North Coast where it's wet and humid. Here it's dry and humid. Um, it's just a different type of climate and the people say that this year and last year were some of the hottest that they could remember. It never used to be this hot. So I don't know where the information for the solar minimum was taken from, like which part of the earth the sun shining on the information was taken from. But I can tell you that definitely here it is much hotter than it was in the past. And another thing, a couple of videos ago, a viewer named Citizen Erased, what a nice name, uh, suggested that I do a vlog. And I'm not sure exactly what that would entail, 
do I show my face or not? What would you like me to talk about? I have opinions about almost any topic you can bring up. And some of my opinions are quite controversial. I am that, in inverted commas, old school type of person. And please let me know in the comments if there's anything particular you guys might, might want me to talk about. I am going to be moving away from the sunsets every day. I'm not going to show you. I'm going to probably show you at least once a week. We'll start for today. Or I don't know if I'm going to get a sunset actually. Because it is very cloudy right now as I am recording this audio. So if we get a sunset, I will show you the first one today. Or whenever I get a nice sunset and then we will take it every seven days from there until we get to the equinoxes and solstices respectively but something I am doing every day is taking that 5 p.m. photo I am working on the analemma and I started back in May last year and I will probably have to do it until June so as to you know get a nice show of where the sun is every day. It's going to be awesome. Cheesemondo did say he will help me. So my altitude is actually 1,300 meters above sea level. So I don't know what that is in feet. You'll have to do your own conversion. But that's how far I am above sea level. And the atmospheric pressure here is 12 point something I will put it on the screen and it's definitely different to at the coast and one thing I noticed about here in the mountains is that we hardly ever get a layer of cloud just moving in one direction or just one layer of cloud there are always two or three layers, two or three different types of clouds, each doing their own thing at whatever level and, and what, whatever direction. So most of the time, I don't actually know what the clouds are doing. I can only see in the video clips after I stop recording. So guys, as I mentioned in the last video, I have a PayPal or well I deleted it now but I can get it again I want a PayPal do you guys think that's a good idea for all the work I put into this channel or do you think I should start a second channel and dedicate that to maybe try and earning some money it's not that I love money I've been unemployed for quite some time and I would love to work but because of the lockdown, there are no opportunities. Businesses are being closed. And the only way to try and make some money now is start your own business, which, you know, the movement is so restricted. And um, there's so many blockages, so many obstacles. I think that I can make a go of making some money on the Internet. What do you guys think? Please let me know in the comments. I don't want to be too brash about it, but I do need to start earning some money. <laughs> so if you guys made it this far, thank you so much for uh, making 2020 not as bad as some people might have experienced. I really had it easy compared to most people. And I hope you come back in 2021 to watch the rest of my observations. Thank you so much for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Please, guys, comment, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and please ring the bell for notifications. And please, guys, stay safe. I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.